Hello everyone, this is the Films of Bensi Entertainment here with another review, this time an app review. We're going to review Elmo's Monster Maker. Now this is unlike all the other reviews I've done, but this is going to be something different. Now I'm going to show you what happens here. Elmo introduces us to a bunch of monsters who are in fact faceless. Now I'll show you what I'm talking about right now. See that? This is what probably uh, caused this app to not exist anymore. I'll go into that a little bit. When you select one of these monsters... The monsters will show you their faceless self, and you'll have to choose one of their noses and eyes. Now, what made this freaky for me at first was the fact that these monsters obviously didn't have any, any faces, except for their mouths. Now, honestly, this app wasn't that bad after I started playing it because I got suddenly used to it, knowing myself as a system history watcher since I was really young. Sadly, the app doesn't exist anymore ever since I started playing it half a decade ago. And ever since, I've always wanted this app to be back on, on of course, the App Store. And if only there was a way to get this app back, please let me know when the app will ever come back. And of course, there's more to this app than I'm I'm covering, but I just want to let the, you know that if only this app would ever come back, just please, just yeah, you know, I just that's all I could review for now. If you guys want want to um. And look into more of this app. Please just look up and look it up on YouTube. Now, honestly, I'm unsure if it's still in the App Store. I tried looking up still, and I even looked up Sesame Street Elmo's Monster Maker, and still not there. It sounds it's too obvious, but I'm still unsure if I'm really gonna find any him soon. But enough of my rambling. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I hope you can uh, enjoy what I've shown you so far in this video. Oh yeah, I kind of forgot to say that I'm sure the only reason, probably, that this app doesn't exist anymore, if I'm sure, is probably because younger kids, much younger kids, were probably traumatized by it, mainly because of the faceless Muppets. But that's just my own speculation. Anyway, see you later. That's all I have to review for now. Okay, bye.